the most is uh, um, Public Enemies at the time, playing John Dillinger, and we were shooting out in some forest, and I got the news, and uh, it was quite unpleasant. Um, and then once I got back home and sort of settled in, the first thing that I felt I needed to do was I, I needed to, because I didn't see Mu for a while before he passed away, you know, I was away shooting. And so um, I wanted to see him, so I painted him. I painted him real big. <laughs> it's a big painting. And um, that was one that was very difficult for me. It was a strange one. Normally you walk away from a painting and get some distance on it. But oddly, when I was painting this portrait of my dog, Moo, I uh, remember that I liked being up very close to the canvas by his eyes because it felt like there was enough, I don't know, um, out of focus, there was enough memory left to sort of experience him better, you know. So I painted this big painting of my doggy, and um, whenever I see the thing, all I look at is I walk, I walk up and put my eyeballs two inches from his, and that's the way the painting works for me. So, yeah, paintings work differently for everybody. Uh, to be, like, straight up, the animal that I love to paint the most is um, is the elephant. I like painting elephants. I like elephants. Yeah, they're kind. There's something kind about them, very kind. Um, let's see. I don't know, I like to paint all kinds of stuff. It depends on what jumps into my brain. Sometimes I, I painted buckets for a long time. It's hard to, I, I mean, I can't even explain that. You know, you'd have to ask some I don't know, professional about it, but yeah, I did. I painted buckets for years. <laughs>